sick of watching that I tell you anyway it's not about the movie it's not a movie review but I uh, um, I will do a quick unboxing and a display of this this fella from Asmus Toys I'll show it that way because it seems to be night guard and I'll show you the back of the box Pretty cool. I actually thought this was a pre-order to tell you the truth. I uh, from Asmus Toys. I they're they're a great small company which um, do uh, some fantastic stuff and uh, and some expensive stuff and some not so expensive stuff. And uh, I prefer to buy the not so expensive stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh um anyway this is how it comes just has the foam on top and the, the sheet of foam on top and very simple simple cat packaging and of course what you get is a nice nice solid figure and what has he got on his arm I have no idea, I haven't got my glasses on. No, can't read it. It's very blurry too. The actual writing you can't read. But it doesn't matter. Tiling in the jackets, it's a zip up. No, it's a non zip up jacket. Okay, blue shirt, black tie, cheap ass belt. <laughs> cheap-ass shoes. The figure is nice and solid but it's, it's not a light toy like uh, you know cheap-ass body. Nice stiff joints and a good likeness to Ben Stiller. I'll just um, just quickly pull stuff out that's in, in the box and then I'll do a little bit of a show for you. Ooh. One thing that's good about um, Asmus is they give you a stand, which is really good. Nice symbols, very um, sideshow, pretty much like sideshows, old style um, st stand, waist grabber, you know, metal, yeah, simple, as long as it holds the figure up. Nothing written on the base, which is cool. Lightman's torch. Not too bad in the detail area. Okay. One casual opened left hand. Looks like a torch grabbing hand, closed hand, left hand. Mm, looks like a trigger type. I suppose you could use it for your torch as well or for grabbing something. Actually, I know what he could be grabbing. <laughs> he could be grabbing. <laughs> the fetch it bone. <laughs> just done that. I did that yesterday and quickly painted it up this morning. 
I made a fetch it bone for him because I love that scene where he uh, he has to um, throw the bone, but he's hiding behind the counter. And he comes out and it's roaring and carrying on and then as he grabs that bone it's like the dinosaur the T-Rex is like shaking his tail like a puppy I <laughs> think I loved it uh, so that's why I did the uh, fetch a bone because that was the classic part of the film which I always love okay yeah, yeah. have the Egyptian style tablet and it's painted in a like a gold and what's very interesting about this is I know you know as they take it off the wall in the movie I think it's like when the creatures are alive it goes gold and what's gold I've actually made a gold one not real gold silly <laughs> just just a uh, it is metal it is it, it is a chrome plated uh, metal which is quite I think it's chrome wouldn't be brass surely no it's just chrome plated um, of the tablet so yeah so you get two tablets and uh, oops yeah metal one plastic one good very good very good I'm, I'm really happy about that a bit of metal. So what I'll do, I'll um, well, thanks for you guys commenting on my my Chuck Norris up there. Uh, it's a slow progress. I'm here and there at the moment. I'm doing little bits of the Batman and uh, gonna work on the Bruce. And I'd like to do the backdrop and everything for for the for this particular custom because uh, the fight scene at the Coliseum was very an important uh, in the martial arts sense to me that was very inspiring we see Bruce Lee do the JKD and um, against up against the uh, traditional style karate it's got a, a meaning to it as well it's not just a fight scene for me so that's why doing this custom with the Bruce Lee and the Chuck Norris is very important to me to have it right and, and have everything there so I will be doing the walls and stuff like that Anyway, getting back to Ben Stiller, also known as Larry Daly from Night of the Museum. Let's put a bit, quick flick up and uh, a few poses of this fella and uh, enjoy, okay guys? Cool, Ben Stiller. Larry Daly in his just casual stand. They got the nose right, that's for sure. <laughs> Jesus. That's the security badge on there, as you can see. It's not very clear what it says, so oh, that's alright. You know, what do you expect for $100? You know, $100 bucks is cheap. I think it was $104. Strip down the side of the pants. The details of the heads, okay, a bit cartoonish, but uh, you know, you know who it is. I still like it. Got that stupid smirk on his face. Okay, there, I've got him holding his torch. And there's his watch, his metal watch. It's got no face on it, but I wouldn't mind putting a face on it. There's Ben Stiller going to throw his uh, fetch it bone, the T Rex bone.
and there's Ben Stiller showing off his tablet. There's the plastic one, and then the metal one. Much prefer the metal one. There you have it guys. One thing I will say that uh, the two left hands, there's not much difference between the casual open hand and the other hand, so anyway, small differences. Uh, this one I made, so just don't expect to get that in the box. So there you have it guys, Night at the Museum, Ben Stiller, Larry Daly, cool, get it while you can guys, it's nice and cheap, test this one out, catch ya.